Hey y'all, if you're interested in how I created this goddess lock updo, please stay tuned. First thing I'm gonna do is braid each side of my hair just past my ears. Next thing I'm going to do is going to take the top middle section of my hair that I did not corn roll and I'm going to make a fishtail braid. <music> Once I'm done with that fishtail braid, I'm going to fold it and shape it into somewhat of a pompadour. Now that I've shaped it to my liking, I'm going to secure it with a few bobby pins. As you can see, you're going to need really more than a few bobby pins. You're going to actually need a lot of bobby pins just to make sure you keep everything in place. Now I'm going to go back to the braids that I first made. And one at a time, I am going to pin them down to the opposite sides of my head. So it's important that when you when you crisscross the braids, you make sure you pin them down so that they're touching each other, leaving no gaps in between. Now I'm just going to take the ends of each braid and tuck them under. Now I'm going to split the rest of my hair into two sections and I'm going to make two large plaits. Now I'm going to do the same thing I did in the previous step. I'm going to take each plait and I'm going to cross it over and pin it to the opposite side of my head. left with only two ends and I'm going to tuck them away just as I did the others. And now I'm going to apply some more bobby pins just to make sure everything is nice and tight.
Of course, I would not be done until I slick those edges down with a little bit of cream of nature edge control. <music> final look a very simple and elegant lock up do hairstyle um, you can not only wear this style with locks you can you can try this style with any type of individual braids i wore this style for new year's and i got an endless amount of compliments so i will be rocking this style sometime again in the near future thank you guys for watching